Good morning, classmates. Um, so I was just thinking that um, we've had a lot of chaos in our world, a lot of negativity, and so I was thinking that a morning devotion every morning to help us get us going, thinking in a positive train of thought, would be very helpful. So every morning, I'm planning on posting a devotion to the class wall. I will do my best to do one every morning and just read it. And please feel free to comment on any um, anything you want to add to it or you feel that is important. So every day, we're going to have a verse of the day. Today's is 2 Timothy 1, 7. And today's our Monday devotion, so we watch it on Monday. So here is 2 Timothy 1, 7, and it says, For God did not give us a spirit of fear, but of power, love, and self-control. God gave us power and love and self-control instead of fear. So we need to use those three things instead of displaying our fear. Now, I think we need to talk about trust. Trust is something... This is our first point. Trust is something that we really need to display to God in this moment. So are you trusting God in this moment? So let's talk about one thing that we could trust God for. So God has given us a promise that he's working for the good, and we need to trust him even when we feel like all hope is lost. And we just need to remember that God's got this. So the verse that I thought displayed this nicely was Romans 8, 28, and it says, We know that in all things God works together for the good of those who love him. The second point is surroundings. I think this is probably the most one of the one of the most important things that we need to think about in this moment in time. So, what are you surrounding yourself with right now? Are you surrounding yourself with news? Are you surrounding yourself with social media or someone that is going to give you a negative point of view? If so, then I can probably see why you are freaking out. Okay, so instead of surrounding yourself with negative things, surround yourself with God. Pray, listen to him, or encourage others. So you could be actually feeling good because God has filled you, and then someone negative could come up and give you all these negative things that are going to bring your day downhill fast. And it's going to give you a negative point of view. This negative point of view is spreading in our world right now. It's just spreading, 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 and everyone's freaking out, and no one is looking up to God in this moment. So we all need to be looking up to God. The third point that I wanted to talk about was prayer. So the power of prayer is super important and drowns out all the negative and God gives us things to be thankful for. So plug into the power of prayer. So now here's something. Instead of watching the negative news or social media where they're just going to post things that are going to make you feel bad, call upon God. I just need to say something. Sorry, but the news is not going to come for you. It's just going to make you feel worse, and you're going to get more worried, more stressed. You're going to spread the stress. You're going to spread the worry. So stop watching it. Just listen to God. He's going to comfort you, and the media is not going to. Okay, hopefully I can post one tomorrow, too. Um, thank you for listening to my devotion. Um, feel free to comment about anything. And I really miss you guys, so hope I can see you soon. Bye. <laughs>